All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Kale on the PV server. She's got some new changes I put on the screen. You can pause if you want to read them all. But the main thing is she can now use abilities and auto attack during her ult. It also is a much bigger range. It hits a lot more enemies. And it's 2.5 second duration for all ranks. So I think Kale's going to be even more of a late game monster. They did take some damage off her abilities and stuff i believe but having the option to hit people while you're ulting yourself in invulnerable is how kale was back in the day how she was meant to be so with how much damage she puts out late game having that invincibility is going to be pretty big i think but we'll test it out now she needs a lot of time to scale she's not even a champion before six just because you have two ranged attacks, either you use E and you get a empowered auto attack, or you use Q, which eats up a lot of mana, doesn't even do that much damage if you don't max it. So at level 6 we get ranged auto attacks. Also a change they added was, uh, let me see if we can help her. I'm just going to pop Ghost and chase him. He wants her. He's dead, even if he flashes. I flash. Okay, anyway, they add 50 extra range on her E auto attacks when you're already ranged. So it's not just empowered, it's also extra range. Let me try and push this in. At level 11, we get these fire waves on our autos, so then we can actually push waves and it doesn't take forever. But the main thing is just trying to hit 6, because then you can actually farm and somewhat trade. You're still pretty weak at 6, but you're not useless. Because this guy's got bone plating. If I want to trade with him, that's all I can do is hit him with that E. And then he's going to keep auto-attacking me. If you can get in range to keep auto-attacking them with your, your melee autos, then you can potentially win fights with lethal tempo. But since he's ranged, if he walks away... Oh my god, the minions are not shooting him. I think we got him. That was close. Yeah, I just wanted the minions to hit him there. There was one minion left that he had that they were all focusing. Malkai's coming for me. I gotta push. I need the cannon. I need it. Got it. Okay, we're gonna hit six pretty quick. I think if he would have rooted me there, I might have been able to kill him because of how many minions there were. But yeah, we're going to do Nasher's Riftmaker Deathcap. Once I hit those three items, should be GG because I'll probably be level 16 by third item. Man, my hand feels weird today. You guys ever have these, like, days where you feel off? Like, my mouse movement just feels like something's off. I don't know. Let me try. My, my click accuracy is going to be down today, but maybe it'll get better as I play more. Like, I want to play some, some skill shots today. I cannot kite with autos. And Kale's basically like playing an ADC. Except you have some self-peel. Okay, action roamed. Oh no, you got two kills. Okay, I killed him twice. He's level four. I'm five. I'm actually almost six. I just want to hit six and then I can fight him. Thing is, he might try to fight me here or trade with me. Oh, he's not winning this. I'm saving my E in case he, like, gets out of range. Or I'll use it for an auto attack, reset it. I need the uh, burst. But just in case he got a gap on me there and I couldn't auto him no more, that's why I was saving the E. Plus, I'd only get one E off in a fight anyway. Okay, so now we got the ranged auto attacks. And we have our ult. So, 2.5 seconds invulnerable and I can hit him back so maybe we could bait him here see 
See, look, I can keep hitting him. And look how big that alt range is. Oh, darn. I thought Malka would do a little bit less damage there. I could have healed, but I think I was still dead. Could have healed and maybe used potion. Let's see. 40 AP, 60 AP, or do I want 10 haste? Actually, we'll take the 60 AP. That seems better. I don't really need haste too much right now. I'm auto attack based. And I don't have enough mana to keep using heal anyway. Dragon. Ooh, Hextech Dragon is really good for Kale attack speed. Gotta pop his bone plating. Uh, Malkite could be around. I do have ghost. I could probably outrun them. Unless I get rooted. After I hit a Q, his resistance are lowered. But he got that shield. Also, I have conditioning that will pop soon. Four minutes still. Wow. It's only eight minutes in the game and I got four kills, so we got a long way to go. I'm still weak. For Kale standards, I'm weak right now. Take a look at that. He's he just out traded me there. Okay's top. If I could stack lethal tempo, I think I have more DPS than him, but short term trades where he procs his free hit passive and then his PTA, he's gonna win those. But once I'm level 11 and I have the waves and I one shot his whole minion wave. An enemy has been slain. Nice. Just Q's down. Nice. The nice thing about late game Kale is uh, she rips through everything. Like even if it's a tank, you shred their resistance. Oh look, red buff skanking my lane. <laughs> yeah, if you didn't know, Nico changes her out on PB. She can practically turn into anything on the map. So if you didn't already see my video, I have a Nico video up on this channel. Came out a few days ago, and I might make another one. But yeah, these Kale changes came out at the same time, too. She's been in a weird spot. She's either, like, super broken or... Lately, I think she's just been really bad and nobody plays her. I think people also just don't want to play to scale. I'm kind of low. I need to push this in base. I still have ult, though, so... I feel like I could do a lot of damage to him while I'm ulting myself. Oh, they got the dragon. And they got the MF. But I have Nashers and Attack Speed Shoes. I could have helped them, but I, I overstayed mid so long. Also, guys, uh, for those who want to get a mouse pad, I just put them on my website last night. I told you guys yesterday they were up, but I just put them up last night. Uh, international shipping is really expensive right now because they're shipping out of uh, right where I live. But uh, I'll try and work on that in the future, get like a fulfillment center or something. But if you're in the US, you want to buy one. Shipping's like 10 bucks. It's a really high quality uh, desk mat. You can go look at pictures of it on zwag.gg, my website. No human is perfect, but I am not human. 
Level 9. Two more to go, and then we have wave clear. Although this Nasher is just... Feels like I got a nice big power spike. Also, Kale feels a bit different. I think it's the skin I'm using, because I normally play Scale with... Or Kale with, like, same, like, two skins or whatever. They got Herald. They went top, though. I'm just gonna keep farming. Who do you guys think is, uh... Oh wait, look at this. This is Nico as a as a minion. I doubt he's oh. Well, he probably didn't realize she could have kept going. But yeah, you can like pretend to be a minion and gank a lane that way and it's it's kinda OP. Ow. Oh, I couldn't ult in time. I wasn't expecting him to swing in and burst me that much. The ignite got me though. That was my bad, I just misplayed. Onto the Rift Maker. I took a turret shot too, which I took two turret shots, I think, which is what killed me basically. Uh oh. That was too slow with the ult. Oh. <laughs> it's alright, I could deal with them. I think the Lulu Polymorph and the Shen might be the most annoying. And Maokai flash rooting me, but I'm gonna be strong. I gotta scale, I gotta scale. Kale rhymes with scale. But yeah, what's scarier? A level 16 Cassidy or a level 16 Kale? It would have the same amount of kills. I guess it depends on what they're against too is a big thing, because Cassidy's pretty good for squishies. Can literally just like one shot him faster than Kale can. I'm popping a ghost. Yeah, my auto attacks. My clicking is really off today. Cause like I I canceled like three autos trying to hit him there. And I didn't feel like flashing, but I should have. I didn't need to if I didn't cancel the autos. I just wasted so much time under that turret. I should have actually just hit the turret. Oh no, plating was still on. It wouldn't have died. Yeah, my pinky just feels like uncomfortable, so it's like it's really weird to click right now. It doesn't hurt or anything, it just feels weird. Even though I have, like, twice as much CS as him, still does a lot of damage. Action, I think, is an early game, early mid-game champ. He falls off pretty hard late from what I've learned from playing him. And I gotta get this wave. I don't think I could have helped him. Okay, I got the waves. Look at me now. Wee. I can push and roam trying to help these fights now. Or I can just run over. I wanted to flash E her, but if she shields, she won't die. Oh my god. I almost killed her by hitting the minions next to her. Oh, I want to do it so bad. I'm not. Oh my god. Almost. He does a lot more damage than me. It's the ignite every fight, though, that's getting me, too. If I have ult, though, I would have won that 100%. It's a pretty long cooldown. Action just pumps out so much damage. And he gets a shield, and he has bone plating. So if the trade's really quick and he can kill me in those, like, two seconds where he's swinging, I can't beat him. But once I have Riftmaker and Deathcap, I think even with ult, I beat him. But we'll see.
It's just he's killing me before I can even stack up lethal tempo or my waves. Pretty back and forth though, so now I'll have ult. I don't want to flash, I don't want to flash. Oh, I lived this time finally. The tower did not want to shoot me again. Okay, so I even killed him through a Shen ult there. But unfortunately, I had to flash. Where's Maokai? Hmm, I didn't get it. Okay, we have Riftmaker, and I'm going Deathcap next. There's a Gromp there. That's actually Nico. That is not the real Gromp. I think he needs to back up a little bit more, but it, I don't think they know. But also, I don't think they care. Uh, I'm not going to be there. You can maybe get Jin if he stays. He's taking forever to clear the ward. I would chase Maokai there, pop Ghost. But Maokai is pretty good disengage with the Q and Alt. Action's gonna pop out. So I'll save my E in case he does. There's Maokai. Oh, he's top. Let me get to turret because there's at least three of them here. Flashed out of the last auto. Get behind the turret. Yes. The fallen will never rise again. Okay. If I use my ult like a half second earlier there too, I would have took no damage. Oh, they got him. Let me see if I could save her. Damn, he went right over my Q. Oh, I'm shredding him. If he would have got hit by the Q, he would have died even faster there also. An ally has been I can maybe dive Jin here. I don't know. I'm going to misclick under the turret again. I missed my Q. I don't think it matters. Look how much damage I'm dealing to him. Oh, that was kind of close. Oh, I'm healing. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, no. <laughs> you revived Jin. I should have ran. But I saw how much I was healing. I'm like, oh, maybe I could heal a little bit more. Okay. Worth. I got two of these bad boys. Two levels till GG. Eight and five. I mean, not terrible. Everybody in this game has died a million times. Doesn't matter what your score is as long as you win the game. And you hit level 16, which means you win the game as Kale. The biggest thing I've noticed from this is like, it's so easy to hit people with your alt now. You had to like flash on top of them before. But it's like, it seems like it's even bigger than a Nico alt. Maybe the same size. Ooh, dragon. We kind of need this one. They gotten two. Ooh, I have a Karma also. I'm coming. I don't have flash or ghost. 
Also, once I'm 16, I don't have to stack up my wave autos anymore. They're, it's just fully stacked, I think, all the time. Well, I hit him with my... Uh... Oh, she pollied me, so I can't auto, but it's okay. Nice. Oh, I almost got a Penta. Okay. Yeah, you know, sometimes you don't even need 16 as Kale. You just need items. My A click's different on this. This PB account. Well, they revive four people if Action kills me. Do I take the risk? Probably not. I'll clear this wave and leave. Level 15, one more to go, but I have a death cap. They're in trouble. Okay, what do I want to go after death cap? I could do Rylize to slow them. Cosmic Drive changed, didn't it? Stack of move speed. Mm, I don't think it's that great. I'd, I'd do a Rylize. Or should I get a void? No, I get a Rylize. I want to just survive. Or slow them. Because if I, if I don't hit my Q, they're not slowed, and it's kind of hard to stick on them. Oh no, you're not getting away this time, bud. Oh my god, my damage. Unstoppable. Could you do like rapid fire with my E and I'm ranged? It would be pretty far. It'd be like out here. Oh, I saw that. Here you go. I didn't think that last auto would get him. Shen's just getting melted. Oh, I'm level 16. The game is over. Come here. Alright, let's see if I can beat action this time. Yeah, I killed him before my ult even ran out there. Nice. Well, all of a sudden I now have 17 kills. What happened? It's only 24 minutes in? Oh man. That was quick, actually. What did I do last? I kind of want to try the rapid fire if we make it there. Where are you? Super long range E. How much do I need? What's the attack speed? It'll be cool. Live long enough, and all lies crumble to dust. I'm fast. I'm just going to back away. Oh. I'll alter. Wait, what the hell? We've been flanked. But the flanker has been flanked. Oh, the Rylize. Oh, I'm so dead here. Oh, maybe not. Hey, there it is. <laughs> I mean... That really isn't impressive on a 22 kill Kale, but I'm just so strong. I want to get the rapid fire really quick. I just want to buy it and see the range. We don't have to fight again. The charged up? Now it is. Wow. That's actually pretty far. Okay, I'll fight him again. It's fun. This game actually, uh, 
didn't take long at all. I played so sloppy, and I mean, it's only 26 minutes in, and I've, I'm full build, almost max level. It came pretty quick, out of nowhere. It was like, Action was just beating me in fights, and then all of a sudden I beat him in fights, and then I kill everybody too. Oh my god, that's so far range. Look at that, I just hit Jin from like a mile away. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm just Kale. I just get to stand still. Wait, what happened to the fifth one? Oh, well. <laughs> Alright, GG. I mean... I don't know if they took any power from her late game. I don't think they did, because uh, once you hit that level 16 and you have all your items, you're pretty darn strong. They couldn't do anything to me, even the tanks. Like, the tanks got shredded. The Rylai's made it so I hit them once and they don't get away. Oh, and what do you know? The servers went down. I went to play on PvE today because any servers are down, and now PvE's going down, but at least it didn't go down during the video, which happens quite a bit. Let's see if the stats will load, though. I can actually maybe look at them in match history, but if I press this, they probably won't be in my match history. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button before you go. Also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Uh, last but not least, comment below and check out my website, zwag.gg. I put up some keyboards and the mouse pads are up, but yeah. International, I'll try and get something for cheaper shipping in the future. If you really want it, buy it. But I have a lot in stock. I have like uh, 500 of them. I don't think we'll sell 500, so we'll see. Oh, yep. PB went down. All right. Bye, guys.